Hey guys, I'm Marty Geek. In this video, I want to share with you guys a little tip here on how to record phone calls using the Droop Dialer. Yes, the Droop Dialer actually got an update, I would say like almost a month ago, that now it lets you record phone calls and it works pretty damn cool. Uh, first of all, what you want to do is go to settings, right? Go to calls. Here you're going to have a tab with a lot of settings. Go to calls. Here you got call recorder call recorder um he got current recorded calls so if you have recorded calls it's going to be right there i did this one testing so like you see there they're all going to be saved there there you go there you go <laughs> like you see there the calls are going to be there saved and i think is as saved as an mp3 file um and here you got show record button during calls so you want to have that enabled that way when you are on a call, you will have like the record button there available and you can start or stop the recording. Um, he got open speaker while recording. If you want to enable that, that's okay. I keep it off because I don't really like to use the phone on speaker mode. Um, here, this is a very cool feature here. It says record selected numbers. Uh, by default, it's put on off right you turn it on if you want to for example this is good for example if you want to record somebody that is calling at your phone a lot of times like a marketer or something like that or some troll calling you all the time right and you want to automatically record that phone call every time that person calls all you got to do is tap right there here you choose people from contacts or recent calls. If I tap recent calls, I could choose any phone numbers that I've been receiving. For example, this is like a telemarketer, 1885. I don't, I don't care who you are. I'm going to add you there. So right there, I add that number, right? Um, this other number right there, I can add other number there that keep calling me. I could click, click done and that's it. Now you have two phone numbers there that if they call me, Boom, automatically those phone calls are going to be recorded without me hitting the phone, uh, the record button. So that's it. That's basically all you got to do. Once you do that, uh, you're done. Um, here, let's say, let's go ahead and test it out so you guys can see. You also have this right here. Like you see, you have these apps. For those that um, are new to Droop, I already have a video explaining all the awesome features from Droop. So I'm not going to go dig into the awesome features that this have. I'm just going to leave a link in my descriptions. That way, if you want to see a video um, showing off the awesome features of Droop, you could see it right there. But this, of course, is new. This is the record button right there as well. So you have the call button. You have the record button. If you tap it. You will also go to the recorded phone calls. Like, see there, you don't have to go to the settings to access your record phone calls. Just tap right there and I'll do it. Uh, here for this video, I'm going to go ahead and test it with Domino Pizza since the, there's a, like a like a voice recorder that um, um, start answering the phone calls. So I'm going to go there, boom, and make the call. And so, see, I dragged the phone call. I dragged the number to the record button. So automatically, it's going to be recording. So it should be recording. Let's see. No, it's still dialing. It's still dialing. So let's go ahead and wait for it to connect. Okay, so it's finally dialing the phone number. Like, see here, I'm going to go ahead and up the volume so you guys can hear it. So right now, it is recording the phone call. Since uh, this is like an automatically um, operator answering the phone calls. So like you see there, it's, you can listen it. Right like now I can go full screen, the next full speaker. There you go. So now, okay, so now we're going to go ahead and stop the recording, right? Let's go and stop the recording. We can also stop the call. So you see that you can stop the recording even before... Uh, finishing the call so we could go back here again tap right there and there you have it we have a whole bunch of times because i tried a whole bunch of times because uh, i i wasn't getting service in my home so here is the phone call that we just did let's go and up the volume up the volume and let's see should be starting pretty soon did it is now hiring delivery drivers. 
Apply online at GoDominoes.com. You can also, you can also listen to my Please voice the in the background as well. So there you go. So that's how you uh, record phone calls using this um, Droop Dialer. Uh, of course, um, those asking me, what is that wallpaper that I have? Why does it look like that? It's because uh, with Droop Dialer, of course, you can also uh, uh, apply themes and apply wallpapers. So like you see here, it says uh, theme gallery, phone gallery. You just tap phone gallery if you want to enter your own photos. Tap right there, right? And here I got, I use uh, one of the downloading photos. But if you want, you could use, like, for example, a wallpaper and uh, choose, like, for example, this one right here. And you could just customize, uh, make the size, choose the size of the photo that you want captured. Click OK. And there you go. And that's it. So that's how you do that just like that like you see there it looks pretty damn cool so guys thanks for watching the video this was a, a video tip on how to record phone calls using the awesome droop dialer that i've been using it since say day one and i and it and it's just been getting better and it's totally free so i'm gonna leave a link in my description for the application and also for the videos that i've done on this uh, dialer that way you could get a little bit more familiar into uh for this so thanks for watching the video, guys. Till next time.